The life-saving drug and uh, plays an extremely critical role for those who suffer with severe allergies. Starting next year, the state of Illinois will require EpiPen injections to be covered by insurance companies for those under 18. Now there's a nationwide push for that to happen in every single state. Here's ABC 15's Carla Navarrete with the details. My son is allergic to wheat, eggs, and nuts. He um, gets anaphylactic and can't, has a lot of respiratory distress with eggs. Seven-year-old Hudson Simbelman is Rosemary's son. Ever since he was nine months old, EpiPens have been part of his everyday life. And we have had to use an EpiPen several times on him in order to get him back to normal and take a little trip to the ER where we have to be watched and monitored for several hours and then released to go home. And it's not just one set of EpiPens Hudson needs to have readily available. There's a set just about everywhere he goes. So we have one that's traveling with him at all times, one with my mom when she's traveling with him, and three at the school. Plus, she says EpiPens have a short lifespan, expiring sometimes without ever being used. The Zimbelman family spends thousands of dollars every year. It will cost us up to $2,2500 a year. Um, and extra money and I, a lot of people don't have that money to put out. I know we have to, you know, put it on a credit card and pay it off little by little. As Illinois becomes the first state to require insurance companies to cover EpiPen costs, Rosemary and her son's pediatrician, Dr. Barnes Clark, both say they hope Arizona follows suit. Watching someone that you love suffer and be actually truly worried that they might not live is already a terrible experience for a parent to go through. And then to financially not be capable of having and keeping available a medication is another paralyzing feeling parents don't need to go through. In Tempe, Carla Navarrete, ABC 15, Arizona.